Welcome back to Daybreak, everybody. Okay, I am a little jealous with John Boster with his food, <laughs> um, but hopefully he'll bring us back some food. Maybe. Yeah, we're hoping. Well, okay, this past Saturday, Edlin traveled east to the market at the grounds to see what amazing food and crafts are being sold there. Let's take a look. Hey everyone, it's Edna Ruiz back again with Island Adventure. Today we're exploring the farmer's market. Well, a simple kind of life never did me no harm. I'm raising me a family and working on the farm. Days are all filled. So I'm here with Vernon, a visitor from the U.S. How are you doing today? Doing great. Lo love the island. Well, why did you decide to come to the market grounds this morning? Well, we were in the Seven Mile Beach and reading some of the publications and we saw the advertisement and home, back home, we have a farmer's market also that we shop at, so we thought we'd see what the, the Cayman farmer's market was. Do you like what you see? Oh, love what we see. You have plenty of vegetables and fruits and all kinds of pastry. We got cakes on the griddle, life ain't nothing but a funny, funny riddle. Okay, so we're here with David, who has a really special product. Can you tell us about it? I can indeed. Uh, I started my business eight months ago. Uh, we have, I'm happy to say, a gourmet sausage now, and uh, we have about ten different types of sausage, ranging from uh, korma chicken curry, jerk chicken, jerk pork, Euro-style British bangers, Borovurst, which is a beef South African sausage. We sell to uh, the restaurants and directly to the public themselves where they can actually have a, a, a private party with their family or friends and uh, they can email us or call us on my number. Okay, we're here with George, one of the vendors at the Market Grounds. How are you today? Well, I'm good today. Yeah, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. How long have you been here and selling your products? Well, um, it's one year now, Friday. It will be the anniversary of the market. Yeah, so we are here. One here. Um, what kind of things have you been selling? I mean, I see some of the things you have here. Um, we sell green bananas, pumpkin, sugar cane, water coconut, peppers, guavas, lime, you name it, a lot of things, you know. Yeah. A wide variety? A variety, yeah. Uh -huh. Mr. Curry, how are you today? I'm doing well, thanks. How are you? I'm great. Why do you want to come out here this Saturday morning? Um, something different to do to get away from town, drive around. We like to uh, get out and see different things. We're on vacation, try and get more of the local culture. Well, what have you tried? Like, what kind of foods have you tried while you're at the markets here? <laughs> um, the sugar plums, which we don't have at home, and then some of the cookies, uh, the homemade cookies, and some of the fruit, basically. made you guys want to come out to the market grounds this morning? Well, we um, wanted to take in some local experiences and um, this has uh, been really good. They teach you about what type of plants they have here, what type of fruits, um, vegetables, all that. They take time to answer your questions and things like that. So that's what we'd heard, so we wanted to come and check it out. Have you liked it so far? Yes, very much. What kind of things have you gotten and got to try around here? Um, we've gotten some mangoes, star fruits. Um, we haven't tried anything yet other than the uh, coconut water, which my son has right now. But um, it's it's good also. Do you like it? Yes, I do. Good. Okay, I'm here with Roger, one of the vendors here at the Market Ground. How are you this morning? I am feeling very good, especially now that I'm appearing at Channel 27. <laughs> well, can you tell me about the products that you have here on the table this morning? Uh, yes, for now, because this is the first time that we are introducing our product here. We only have the avocados, the guavas, and some seasoning pepper, and of course some plants which I call the bonsai pineapple. Right now, we're with Ms. Carmen Connolly. How are you this morning, Ms. Connolly? I'm good, thanks. And you? I'm great. Can you just tell us a little bit about all the things that you have here? Okay. I have straw work, I have um, baskets and tissue holders for bathroom. I have, these are hangings done from the silver thatch too, the same as the basket. And then I have some shell work. These are, um, we hang these on the, on the Christmas tree and they go real good. This is um, a natural pen holder for 
from the milk. That's our one of our native um, seafood dish, <laughs> and it comes in like a natural pen holder. I did these um, like rose shell gather shells from the beach. Well, thank you so much for showing me all the great things that you have here. Thank, thank you for your time. Thanks for joining me at the Market Grounds. See you next week with another island adventure. Well, this weekend is the Market at the Grounds one year anniversary and they are kicking off the celebration today with a family fun day starting at 2 p.m. And the celebration continues tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. They're going to have lots of crafts oh, and music. Good. And of course, we all know food, food, food. Ooh, I have an early morning run with my girlfriend. So I think from that, I'm going to go to Market at the Grounds and see what's yeah. out there. Yeah. Today's going to be good because they're going to have Bouncing Castle and um, all kinds of great stuff for the kids to do. Uh -huh. So take the kids up there if you're able to do that today and I think that uh, goes from 2 until 8 tonight and then tomorrow of course is regular hours from 7 a.m. and lots of uh, lots of more activities and things to do with especially the entertainment so yeah. go out and be a part of it tomorrow. It's got to be music to the ears of parents whose children are still out of school <clears> and they're <throat> looking for them to find things yeah. to do. There you go. Two there you today. go. <laughs> and Lynn you did such a good job. I can't cute. wait to see what you're going to do next week for another island adventure right here on Daybreak every Friday so tune in. We're going to take a break. We'll be right back with more, so stay with us.